guys, it's Peter from Double XL. I'm here with Ski Master Slump Guy. What's I'm Beyonce. Up? My name is Beyonce. <laughs> so um, today we're at Origins in New York City. We at the OG, bitch. And um, tonight it's all about your style and, and your, your aunt album. and your auntie. You're somebody that's always had a really kind of a unique style of your own. Obviously, when you were first coming out, it was with the do rag and the headband. And um, but now you're kind of bringing something new to the game with the Gucci socks with the Crocs. You did. Yeah. Um, what was it that sort of inspired you to pair that high-end fashion with something kind of unexpected like Crocs? Um, I'm one person that likes to do like shit differently. I hate anything that seems like something has been done. So it's like I'm trying to bring something that has never been done, that would never usually be done, that's actually cool. So it's like this thing actually made Crocs fa. That's exactly what the fuck I did. I never seen this in white, brother. You see this in white? I needs this. I'm finna get them. Yeah, and you and you made a song, right? Yeah. Like Gucci style with the Crocs. And what you doing? Fuck Gucci style with the Crocs. Fuck Gucci style with the Crocs. Real rich niggas on my belly like pot of gold. Look at y'all my watch. Fuck Gucci style with the Crocs. Fire, and you can see them for yourself. Dripping all over. Um, I'm not. Hey, wait, hold on. Shout out to my dog Peter too. Yeah, it was good. <laughs> Definitely good peoples here with Ski. Um, obviously here we've got Turtle stuff rags. like this. Um, we've got this Gucci hoodie. Uh, pump got cool this. Styles. Yeah. The pump ass got this. Hey, look. Hey, pump. You can't dress. I ain't gonna lie. I don't know if you dress yourself or somebody dress you. Whoever do, tell them to stop immediately. No, I'm just playing. No, say, I'm not playing. Though. What about something like this? Is this something you'd rock? What does that say? Gucci Spiritizo, I think. I would, I would. Just because of the, just because of these. A lot of people wanna, like I said, I like to do different shit. A lot of people wouldn't put these shits on there because it's like, it's bedazzles. You know what I mean? And people don't really fuck with bedazzles unless it's diamonds, but my nigga, ketchup on drip, fuck you me. Definitely, and so this is pretty much the ski mask style. Yeah, I'd, I'd rock this. How much is this actually? Is that right? Oh yeah. It's going back right where it was. <laughs> Word. What was the point or like the experience where you were just like, yo, Gucci is dope, I wanna wear Gucci? Um, Gucci actually looks good. That's the point of it. It's, um, there's a lot of clothes that uh, get bought for high expenses, like more than it should be because it's a name brand, but the clothes actually look better than like the cheaper clothes. Like if you look at this, cotton, well, I don't even know if this cotton, look at this bumblebee, G. They hand stitched that. They had to. Right. You're someone whose styles like really kind of evolved over the years. You Definitely. Know, like, ski mask. As a person too. Yeah, exactly, exactly. More importantly, as a person. But um, <laughs> <laughs> but um, you know, ski mask. Your styles kind of evolved over the years, and it's like ski mask in 2018 probably isn't wearing exactly what ski mask in 2015. Hell like, no. You know, like in 2015, Hell you know no. what I'm saying? Maybe it was. Bur it was that. Birkenstocks. Yeah, Birkenstocks. I was wearing Birkenstocks. <laughs> I was rocking Birkenstocks. No Gucci socks, though. But Birkenstocks. No, and you were wearing and like. And Cole stole it from me. You know what I'm saying? You were wearing like vape. You know yeah, I, mean? I was wearing, wearing a lot of babe. Wearing, That's cool that you know that. No, I was, you know, I, like I was wearing a lot of babe. Uh, babe was, was my shit. Babe still is my shit. Um, I like a bit of nape way more than the Supreme for some reason. I don't know. You Bay know. the neighbor supreme. That's something to debate about in the comments. Your your style, a low key style innovator, as we can see by the Gucci styles with the Crocs. Definitely. But um, who is somebody that coming up as a rapper um that really kind of inspired a part of how you dress? I like. There's nobody that I can, I can say inspired how I dress right now. Well, let me put this some some thought into this. Yeah, there's really nobody that can taught me how I dress like me. And X wore whatever the fuck we really just wanted to. Like, if we look crazy, we really don't give a fuck. For some, for some reason, we can always just pull off some shit. So if you give me some motherfucking open toe sandal, Jesus sandals, I'm finna rock the fuck out them hoes, and I'm finna rock the fuck out them hoes. In New York, I really rock. <laughs> Facts, no, that's really dope. So what you're saying is your style is kind of adaptable. It's adaptable, definitely. Um, I can't position it anywhere, because it's like, I'd rock Crocs, designer jeans, thrift store shirt, and like Gucci hat or some shit. <laughs> Another thing that obviously I feel like is sort of synonymous with Ski Master Slump God is um, the do-rag. 
you know, it's <laughs> almost like your bat signal. You know, it's like, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like when I see when I see a durag, I think ski mask. <laughs> Oh, that's that? fire. Imagine seeing a bat signal with a do-rag. Like. Yeah. <laughs> no, feel me. But I was going to say, with that in mind, and you like fashion, obviously, um, would you ever be interested in coming out with your own line of do-rag? Yeah, definitely. I'm going to um, definitely come out with my own line of do-rags. Um, eventually, when my hair goes back to a certain point, I'm going to start re retwisting it and then untwisting it and then start wearing bandanas like I used to. I used to wear white and black bandanas. Um, there's a lot of skis. There's a lot of skis. Um, adapt to yourself, bro. What I want to say is like, don't let nobody tell you that you should stay in your lane, bro. If you feel like you only look good with black hair, my nigga get the opposite of black hair. She shit. You know, just experiment with yourself. You have one life. Live that shit. How would you describe your style now in 2K18? The best way to explain my style is unorthodox. Literally, what I figured out is that Nothing's cool until somebody makes it fucking cool. If you do something and you do it right, you're gonna make that shit cool. You could do anything, my nigga. G shit, anything. Would you say that the way you dress kind of kind of mirrors your approach to music? Definitely. And my personality. It just speaks for itself. If somebody if you see somebody dressing like me, you know they're purposely trying to dress like me, because I just dress like nothing. I dress <laughs> dead ass. I put this on, this with like uh I'd put a hat on that shit. I'd put a hat on a, like a hat, like something shit like this with this. Put the, make the hat, make sure that this pokes out of the hat. I'd wear so, but I like wearing weird shit, different shit. No, Just, and that's sort of the thing, right? It's so like, I love Lady Gaga. No, I love you, Lady facts. Gaga. No, yeah, everyone should love Lady Gaga. I love you. It's unethical not to. Earlier we talked a little bit about Bape, um, and look where we are. All right, yeah, so um, tell me about some of this drip. Like, what do you like about it? I've never seen this one before. This is Baby Milo. I'm usually into like the bait that's like uh, colorful. Colorful. I love colorful bait. So it's like some shit like this, some shit like this. Eh, I really wouldn't rock this, I don't know. Some shit like this, different colors. Pink, some shit, some shit. I never really seen the baby Milo shit. Word. I look good in pink. Pink. I'm not gonna lie. Shout out to Cam. That ass. I look good in pink, purple, and yellow. And blue. Those are my aura colors. So my whole aura is yellow, blue, purple. You can see it. So if you're trying to cop ski mask a Christmas gift, you know what colors to buy it in. Yeah. If you're trying to cop ski mask a Christmas gift, you know what you could buy? Some cigarettes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, dude. It's been awesome talking to you about your style. Good talking to you and thanks for coming up. I fought with you, Peter. Definitely. Hey! Gang, 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 gang. Fuck with the OG, you dig? Okay. You know me, you know me, you know me. I swear to God, I love the color of rice. Hell no, them shit's only $400. Can I send you over tomorrow? 700 fucking dollars for some fucking corduroys, my nigga.